of course, by Michael Jackson. Mm -hmm. So, our first little segment here is trivia question number one. Take it away, Philip. Okay, I simply want to know what album did this song appear on? We're going to give you guys at home a chance to figure this out, but I want to know if you guys know. What I it have is. no idea. Oh, no. <laughs> the album that was released in 1988. What was it called? Okay. All right. The answer is bad. Bad. Oh, 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 on the wire. Oh, ding, 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 ding. I had one last chance and I just went for it. Hail, you know? <laughs> well, there you go. That was the first question of our trivia <laughs> portion of today. Uh, let's see what else we got. All right, we're back for question time trivia. So here we are, trivia number two. Now my question is, and I'm I'm really hoping you get this, I really but this is it. this is kind of it's up for grabs. Okay. So the question is in the music video for "Hit Me Baby One More Time." What sport is referenced in that music video? Is it basketball? Yeah, it's basketball. I don't know. Ooh, I, I just know. see a basket court. In I front just of me. yeah. I, I know think that so. they're in a gymnasium. Mm -hmm. Can we decide? On a basket court, a basket. I think it's wrong because he doesn't seem excited about my answer. Tell me, what is the it? The correct answer is you're both right. It's basketball. Oh, oh. oh. All right. uh, yes. She used to play basketball, and oh. she wanted to use that as like a little reference to her back at her basketball days. Well, there you go. So there you go. I didn't think you guys. I thought it would be like right on the cusp or something, but you guys got it. So that was question time trivia. Woo All right. I have to pull out this thing so you guys can see because it, it's trivia time! <gasps> trivia! 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 <laughs> All right, Weird Al Yankovic is amazing. He's done lots of parodies. I want to know which artist's song has not been parodied by Weird Al. Okay. Madonna, okay. Prince, Cindy Lauper, James Brown. Out of those four, which one has he never parodied? I don't know, know the Lauper lady. The Lopper Lady. I don't know. I don't know who that is. I don't know. <laughs> Who's the Lopper Lady? Who's the Lopper Lady? Sounds like a, that sounds like an axe murderer who happened to be female. Yeah, yeah, She's yeah. the Lopper Lady. Get out of here. <laughs> Whash. Whack. <laughs> I, I will say her because I don't know who she is. I also want to say Cindy Lopper. The Lopper Lady. The, the Lopper lady. lady. Okay, so they both go for this axe murderer, Cindy Lopper, the Lopper Lady. <laughs> yeah. The correct answer is strangely Prince. Oh, really? Yes. She, he did Girls Just Want to Have Lunch, which is a Cindy yeah, Lauper yeah, yeah. parody. Oh, he did Madonna uh, Like a Surgeon. Yes. Uh -huh. And with uh, James Brown, he did Living with a Hernia, which is Living in America. Ah. But uh, he did. He always tried to, you know, convince Prince. But Prince was like, he was he wasn't about that parody stuff. Oh, he was like I see. a little bit of a like, Prince is a legend and I love him. But he was a little bit like, nah, don't don't mess. Don't mess around with my stuff. So, All right. so. But there's a lot of Prince parodies out there. So I thought that like, weird he always respects the artist's wishes and he never goes cool. like behind their backs. So. I like you. Baboon. I like you. Here. He's cool. Lapa Lady. It's Lapa Lady. For you tonight. <laughs> so it's going to be Lapa Lady. <laughs> we have to do a sketch at the end of this with a Lapa Lady. <laughs> you get all dressed up in some weird. I'm the Lapa Lady. <laughs> Coming July 17th. <laughs> I'm going to wake you up in the morning. Lapa Lady. <laughs> all right. Jeez. Boom. Uh, what's our next segment? Let's move all on. Right. Welcome back, and we are here at the final segment of today's episode, Oof. the lightning round. Lightning <laughs> round! Okay, so here we are, lightning round in the world of fandoms. I simply want to know, what was the first cartoon that you were crazy about? Mine was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, go. Oh, Simpsons. Pokemon. All right, the next one, uh, the first movie you were crazy about, go. Uh, A Knight's Tale. Men in Tights. Uh, Spaceballs. And the last one is first TV show you were gaga for. That 70s show. show. Oh, my God. Uh, that 70s show. I'll just say MacGyver. You'll just I have to say. Simpsons say. again. Uh, yeah. Go Sorry. with Simpsons because I mean, it's a cartoon and it's a television exactly. show. Exactly. Yeah. And that's yeah. literally what I wanted to watch as a kid. All right. There cool. you go. Awesome sauce. That was our lightning round. Pow. Pew, 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 pow, 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 pow. After Effects. All right. Thank you so much for tuning in for this first episode. We hope that we'll see you again because we will do many more. Have a great one. But before we leave, we have to tell you a few interesting, very informative and very important <laughs> Uh, information. It's very important information. Go, Philip. <laughs> very important. Very important information. Next month, sorry, uh, we're going to have a different theme, and the theme is going to be all about first crushes. Ooh. Ooh. 
feel <laughs> naughty already. You're going to get the full dish. Mm-hmm. But while you wait for that episode to be released, you can find a lot more fun things from us. We're on Facebook and y- Instagram and Instagram. YouTube yeah. uh, at cool. Covers of My Place. On all of them. So uh, watch out there because we'll be releasing some maybe behind the scenes things when we're rehearsing or uh, maybe some bloopers. We've got a few of them. So uh, (laughs) stay tuned and we'll see you next month. Bye. Bye. Bye.